Okay, um, welcome to, okay, I'm gonna call this, um, part two of, um, uh, my opinion of, uh, Sonic X Sally. Now, with me today is, once again, Shadow the Hedgehog. Hello, human. This picture disturbs me so. And finally, Princess Sally from Sad AM has actually made it down here to be able to help me out with this. Oh, this is so dreadful. I know, Sally. I know. Now, I do not know the details. I will look them up. But the details were pretty vague from what I found. Basically, okay, I don't know at all if this is true, but this is my theory. I think what happened was, is, um, like, I think the not whole Freedom Fighters, you, you know, it's Sonic, Sally, Bunny, Rhoda, Miles Tails Prowler and Antoine de Coyote. Now, I believe them and uh, some other people from the comic books, I think they went to the Death Egg. I am not sure. I do believe it's the ruins of the Death Egg they're standing in, though. So, I believe what happened was is that they went in, you know, to stop Eggman for the final time. You know, like an endgame scenario where Eggman would finally die. Which, like, he's... In the comic books right now, he's pretty a mad genius and crazy. But in the games... Like, I'm sorry, but I like the game version of uh, Eggman better. He's a... Uh, I view Eggman as a goofball. But, uh, moving on... As you can see with this picture... Um, uh, it's, uh, it's not very hard to figure out what happened. Apparently, at one point during the mission, Sally got caught in a roboticizer. I'll, again, I'll have to look it up. But, basically, what you see here is the, the cover to a comic book. I do believe it's the cover. Now... The pictures and videos, if you're viewing them in the order, chronological order of which I've uploaded them, well, in that order, you would, uh, you would kind of be confused. Why am I doing part two of uh, my opinions on Sonic X Sally when I just did a whole stream of videos actually about Scourge and Fiona and they are mostly about Fiona there's not much to cover with Scourge but moving on Sally without me saying anything more what do you what do you think um I, uh, and also Shadow please give your two cents besides it's kind of disturbing to look at well in my opinion this is just dreadful I can't imagine Sonic ever letting this happen to me. Well, knowing how noble Sonic is, she's right. Problem. There's been plenty of times, for instance, when Sonic was unable to stop something from happening and he let it hang over his head. Now, personally, if you had me in a chokehold, I'd blow off your head. I'm sorry, I don't care how much I love someone. They attack, game over. Real comforting. Who is this guy? Um, it's Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh, okay, um... But my question is, who's Eggman? I'm from, uh, Sad AM, so I wouldn't have any clue. Um... 
Dr. Eggman is, um, you could say a different version of uh, Dr. Julian Robotnik. His name is Dr. Ivo Robotnik, but everyone just calls him Eggman. In Japan, he was always known as Eggman. In America, we knew him as Robotnik. They got tired of having to localize that. Because there was always these Eggman puzzles and Eggman plastered everywhere. So, like, if you saw my, uh, like, a uh, couple parts of my Sonic Adventure DX playthrough, in one of the parts, I explained that, well, Robotnik is now Eggman. And that's pretty much the reason. And actually, uh, son, uh, they tried to make Eggman an insult, but because of the design of the game, like, there's Eggman puzzles everywhere. If Eggman hates the name so much, why? Uh, but I really don't care. I, I separate the two by their first names. Eggman's first name is Ivo. Robotnik's name, first name is Julian. Julian Robotnik, I kind of see as a bowling ball. <laughs> it, it, it's oh so true. Hmm, I've yet to see a picture of this one, but it might be cool. Now, if you guys saw part one, you know kind of my problem with this. But, yes, it's a great plot, nice little twist, and I'll be showing over the cup next couple parts uh, some pictures, some various pictures of Sonic fighting Sally or just being strangled by her. And you'll see that they decided to have Sally not be convinced by Sonic's words. That's impossible. Even if I was roboticized, I would still listen to Sonic's voice. I mean, his Uncle Chuck got broken through too, didn't he? Very true, Sally. Uh, Shadow, what do you think? Well, human, if we all remember from your various parts and videos, everyone should understand by now what you say. And I'm shocked and amazed they did this too. This is my first knowledge. She looks downright evil. I want to see a picture of me and her battling it out. She actually might be a challenge. Okay, if Scourge shows up, um, I think I'm just going to shoot him in the head personally this time. I mean, um, I'm sorry guys, but Scourge is annoying. I'm ignoring that right now. Damn it, go away. Oh, screw it. Okay, just come in without saying anything. Um, uh, who's she? She looks familiar. Hey, y'all. What's up? Uh, Sally, you, uh, you ain't evil and all robotic like you are on that, on that nice little computer screen there. What, what? Oh. Um, time paradox? Um, I'm not sure, Shadow. Um, did Sonic send you over? Actually, yeah. He said he couldn't make it right now. He's too low in grief. So I came. Um, 
Antoine couldn't make it because apparently someone sent him a death threat if he came in here. What? You two did? Hey, we hate the guy's guts. If you want to figure out why, just view a different video, please. Uh, I'm sorry, guys, but... I just hate him. He's a coward. I can't deal with cowards. Cowards should die. All cowards should die. Ugh, should die. Sorry. Okay, let's get, you know, let's, let's get down to it. Now, I'm going to start talking about this image and what it means to me. To me, this is the first time Sonic has seen Sally this way. I realized that Sonic, like, everyone survived the crashing of the Death Egg. This is my theory. I don't know what really happened. I'll look it up. But... Really, I believe the it is a death egg, and they, it fell, it fell down the Mobius, and like Sally got caught in the roboticizer or something. I don't know if they show that, but Sonic obviously, I don't, I can't tell if he has no idea. Well, he definitely had no idea she'd react this way. And if you ain't Sally, who are you? I am Sally Acorn. I'm just from the TV show. Uh, what? The Saturday M cartoon. It, uh, it ran during the, uh, 1993 to 1995, I believe. Yeah, I think so, too. I ain't following you. You can't be Sally. Sally's all evil at the moment. Oh, by the way, I have a foolproof way uh, if she does come through this door. Oh, guess what? She's going to be meeting a, a one-man army. More like a one-man fan character army. But let's just hope that, you know, she don't come through. Because I don't want to have to break him out so early. Gotta keep him in his cage. He's kind of furious. Oh, my stars and heavens. Why did people come up with this? Oh, uh, correction. I came up with this character. It's very original to me. It's very dear to my heart who this person is. Consider him a part of me. So if any of you steal him, I will rip you apart. Theoretically. Cricket, 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 cricket. Okay, continuing. Sorry, but... Here... And I believe that's Nicole that's kind of been smashed over in the corner. Now, without looking at any of the pictures I have... Uh, I do not believe that Sally can move her eyelids. If that makes sense. Well, she's a gosh darn robot, what do you think? I'm ignoring that because I didn't invite anyone this time. God, yes, hello. Oh my gosh. Ah, jeez. I had a feeling there'd be a lost puppy to come along, but I thought it'd be Tails. Sorry, Shadow, the vote the fans haven't voted yet. That actually might be a long time coming. Oh god, it's it can't be. Please don't oh oh. Why are they so close? I, yeah, why do they have two gold rings on there? Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. You two need to leave. <laughs> We're trying to talk about a very grim subject here. Bow. 
Jeez Louise, boy, you got a problem. Yes, sir, what is wrong with me and my wife kissing? You know what? That's it. That is it. Damn it, I can't die by bullets. Is that all you have in here? Well, that is a Nerf gun, so... Damn it. Okay, moving on. Okay, Antoine. Why don't you come here and talk about this subject? Oh no, please, no. My princess has been... Roboticized! <laughs> I am Silver, again! Shadow, please don't kill me! Shadow, let's let him stay this time. Um, as far as I can gather by just looking at this, um, it seems that Sonic has a thing for this robot. That's disgusting. It's not man and robot, it's man and wife. Silver, get your idiotic rear out of here before I shoot you again. Oh, you are mean, cruel hedgehog. Now, I think someone needs to put you in your place. My place is above everyone. I am the ultimate life form. Will you two not argue, please? I'm trying to do a nice little review here about a very grim subject that I don't even think anyone, like, I haven't had any comments yet. You know, to date, this is my second day. But when I upload it, it might be later. Well, it might be today. I don't want to be shoving a whole bunch of videos down people's throats. But... Even though I don't want to, like, uh, the views and comments would be appreciated. I mean, I would love to have people be just so into what I'm doing. I mean, it's pretty original what I'm doing. Like, it's not like people haven't reviewed relationships before. But the way I do it, I view as original. Shadow? Well, I am the ultimate life form, and I wouldn't endorse it if it wasn't that way. If I may venture a word? Um, my opinion right now is that that's not me. Okay, I can't make a, a assessment based on that. But what I can say is... Based on the information that I've been able to gather as well, that's why I didn't come the last video. Um, last video not being the last part, but the last vi the last couple videos you've done, the Taz 96. Well, I haven't been here because I've been researching topics that you might do. And the one, if you really hate the Bunny Antoine hookup, why don't you do that? Well. Why do you think I invite over Saturday M Bunny and Saturday M Antoine? Duh, sorry. Sally, on my list of Saturday M characters that are my favorite, well, Sonic is second, you are third. Oh, well, I'm okay with that. Antoine is six. Yeah, you pretty much told that. Figured that out. Well, Tails is fifth, and Road is fourth. Uh, we've seen Tails a lot. He's far too kiddish, in my opinion. Tails, I know Tails is a super smart guy. So, that's just me. Bunny's my favorite character. Oh, that's why you hate this hookup so much. No, I hate it because you're a brave person matched up with a coward. You went about this in all the wrong ways. And you, you are so lonely. You probably did a couple things with yourself while... Looking at a picture of her. <laughs> oh, why, you little demon child! Hey, you touch a hair on his head, I will wring your neck. And then shoot it off. 
Um, while they're at each other's throats, uh, I'll just come here by the mic, and I would just like to say, um, like, my question is, uh, why do you hate me? Silver, so venture a guess from all the words you've just said. Oh, Bowie. I'm sorry. That's how they made my voice. It's no use. It's no use. Uh, uh. Hey, my psychic sense is tingling. Oh, brother. He has to be more annoying than me. Actually, no, you are more annoying. Just shut the hell up. God. <laughs> They're making me go insane. Okay, back to the topic. Um, character design. Let me go over that. Uh, character design's pretty dang accurate. She's all robotic now. And pretty much it. There's, there's not much to say about character design. It's pretty simplistic. It's pretty well based. Well, in Sadiem, uh, Sadiem Sally, uh, did... You know, um, does Sonic ever tell you about any nightmares that he's had? Shadow, you and I know the answer to this. Um, no, he actually never brought up any nightmares. Uh, why? Well, apparently, the audience saw it, but you didn't. Apparently, Sonic was having nightmares about you actually being roboticized. Except you all steel-looking and, uh, you know, like, uh, like a gray metal instead of, uh, this colored, uh, this colorization for Roboticized Sally actually came around for the comic books instead of the cartoon show. In the cartoon show, everyone was just turned into, like, like, I don't know why she didn't have color, Uncle Chuck did, but most of the time they were just, uh, they had, uh, red eyes. And they were basically a straight gray, like a, a like a steel color gray. Now, the one line that kept echoing echoing in those nightmares was, "Sonic, where were you when the brains were handed out?" Does that sound like something you would say? Yes, it does. I do say that to Sonic on occasion. Oh, and, uh, apparently you had a date with him. So, how'd it go? Do you boys have anything else to do with your lives? Leave the girl alone. Yes, leave the little princess alone. You are completely rude. Hey, Antoine. Your wife may be strong, but my guns are bigger. And I don't think she can stop it. assault rifle. Note, I do not have any guns in my room, nor do I have access to them. Just play along. Okay, let us continue. I don't think she can stop the uh, guns, okay? So, pipe down, annoying chatterbox. Hey, you leave my husband alone. I will get up, woman. God. Nice stand up for yourself. She could strangle you, you know. Nice neck crack, human. Thank you. Now, let's just see how long we've gone. 24. Okay. This is going to be, uh... Part 2, up next will be part 2.5 of uh, my opinions of uh, Sonic uh, x Sally. I'm sorry, but I get carried away. So until I learn the magic of editing to like cut these videos in half, I will see you next time.